Hello, my name is Alan and I'm the owner of GoTru. In this uh, tutorial, we're going to talk about blue lines on Google Street View. Now, before talking about blue lines, we have to understand there are uh, two types of blue lines on Google. One is when we upload the images, like individual panoramas to Google, and one we, where we upload 360 videos to Google. Now, GoTru supports both. and in this tutorial, we're going to focus on the first one, where we are uploading uh, three individual 360 panoramas to Google. So let's go ahead. To start, you would first go ahead and create a, a new tour, and you would select the Google Business. Now, in here, we're going to type on nearby address to where the blue lines wants uh, you, you need the blue line to be. And let's say that's uh, the street that uh, we want to publish and I'm going to hit create new tour. Upload the panoramas um, and then moderate uh, the listing. And then let's go back to our sample tour. Um, once you finish, probably the your tour will look, gonna look something like this. And um, the next step would be to click on Google and then advance. Once you go to advance, you have to make sure you uncheck this checkbox and that will what will do is basically go through will not associate the place ID to the panoramas and by not associating the place ID to the panoramas, Google will create a blue line. But before uh, actually publishing the tour, uh, Google has two uh, uh, requirements for a blue line. First is you need to have at least 25 panoramas for Google to create a, a blue line. Second, uh, the distance between the panoramas need to be between 3 and 5 meters. Probably between, between a few panoramas, you can go a bit uh, like a, a more distance, up to seven meters, but I would not do it like constantly for all the panoramas because you risk not to, to end up with the blue line. So again, once uh, you you unchecked the, the panoramas from here, you click and uh, after in each, uh, right after the publishing, you will get blue dots. Google will take some time to process uh, the, the images and by the end, uh, I, I don't know, in a few days, you will end up with a blue line. In this particular case, we can uh, check and this is, uh, this is our blue line. Uh, yeah? So this is our blue line. Now, uh, there are a few things that uh, we need to understand about uh, uh, blue lines. And basically, when you create a blue line via uh, the individual panorama pipeline, uh, Google will not jump uh, over multiple images. And another thing is that Google will not blur any uh, license places and will not blur any faces in your panorama. So you will have to do that via the go through moderator. So that's um, how you can create a, a blue line uh, from individual panoramas um, and upload them to, to Google.